my channel and thank you so much for watching so today i have for you this really glamorous and dramatic makeup look this makeup look is more of my side of glamorous and dramatic at the same time i really love this kind of makeup look and i hope that you enjoyed the story as well so if you want to see how i got this makeup look stay tuned and let's get started so let's get started this makeup tutorial and for today's video I'm gonna start using the Paint Pot Soft Ochre by MAC. I really love this eyeshadow base because it's a little bit yellow and works as a concealer at the same time. So I don't have to work twice, applying first the concealer and then the eyeshadow base to stick the eyeshadows on. I really like this eyeshadow base because I have two in one and also this eyeshadow base will help my makeup look to stay on all night long. Especially for prom, this is what I'm looking for. As my transition shade, I'm gonna start applying the eyeshadow blur by Melt Cosmetics with a big fluffy brush. So I'm gonna buff it out using circular motions to create a nice blended look. This is the color that I'm gonna apply in my eyelid as well because I really like this shade and this will create a nice transition of colors between the brown using warm shades. I really like this combination. So now using a smaller blending brush, I'm gonna apply the color Unseen. This is from Melt Cosmetics cosmetics as well and I'm gonna apply this shade that is just a little bit darker than the previous one in my crease and outer corner to start creating a depth in my eyes and I'm gonna use this color in my lower lash line as well always blending circular motions to create a more drama and dimension in this makeup look as you can see I'm not gonna apply a lot of black eyeshadow I'm gonna keep this look in the browns so I'm gonna use a lot of them and now I'm gonna apply the color rust using the same brush I'm gonna place this color in the outer corner and using circular circular motions I'm gonna blend it to the crease as well and this part is optional I don't wanna apply any eyeliner in my makeup look because I wanna do something different for you guys to try out but if you want you can add a little eyeliner and I wanna do something wearable for everybody so I'm using only neutral eyeshadows but in the warm side to give a little bit of life in the look and I really like this combination please comment below what you think and if you have any suggestions for the next looks that you wanna see here in my channel please comment below and let me know what you think so i'm using the same color unseen in the lower lash line again just to complement the look a little bit and next i'm gonna apply the same color rust the same colors that i applied on top i'm gonna apply in the lower lash line and to smoke it out i'm gonna use the same brush as well as you can see this makeup look is nice and it's easy you don't have to use a lot of products you don't have to use a lot of brushes just take your time to blend nicely all the eyeshadows until you have a pretty look now i'm using a eyeliner brush and the gel liner wicked by sigma i'm gonna use this product to line my waterline but this is optional you can use a pencil if you want i like to use the gel liner because for me it's easier to apply and also lasts much longer than the pencil so this is up to you what you feel comfortable with you can use it what is important here is to get a nice and flawless finish now i'm gonna use a short shader brush and a little bit of the black eyeshadow this is the shade dark matter by melt cosmetics as well and so I'm gonna place this color in the lower lash line to create this nice and dramatic smoky eyes it's looking so dark now but when I apply the false lashes it will look stunning so I was thinking what I'm gonna use to highlight this part is optional I'm using this gorgeous highlighter from Urban Decay I like this highlighter to use as my eyeshadow because as you can see it has some glitters and I don't like to have a lot of glitters in my face so I prefer to apply this highlighter in this all matte look to give a little bit of shine you can use any fine glitter that you have at home to have this pretty effect in this all matte makeup look or you can skip this step and use all the look matte also you'll look so pretty or even if you don't have to use glitter you can use just a shimmer eyeshadow but since this looks for prom i want to give you this option i love this makeup look because it's wearable and fabulous at the same time so you can play with the colors and play with the eyeshadows play with the textures and have the flawless finish that you want and now for my natural stunning glow in the skin i'm gonna use the warm glow highlighter by too faced i love this stuff so much as you can see it's so pretty and have a perfect finish in the skin i'm using to apply this product the phone strobing brush by sigma so i'm applying this highlighter everywhere i want to highlight my face concentrating the product in the height points of my face in the high 
my cheekbones in the cupid's bow and a little bit in my nose and for my lips i couldn't find anything better than this lip combo between all the lipsticks that i have here for this look i wanted something new i wanted matte and shiny at the same time and at the same time a little bit of ombre effect so i'm using the lip liner sugar spicy by george cosmetics I think this is the right name, I can't remember but I'm gonna put all the links here down below for you guys of all the products that I'm using if you're interested and my discount codes as well. So I'm gonna just line my lips in the natural shape and the liquid lipsticks that I'm gonna apply is the color Nude by George Cosmetics as well and on top of it I'm gonna apply the shade Dream Weaver that is a metal matte liquid lipstick and I'm gonna dab a little bit with my finger just to mix this liquid lipstick in the middle of my lips and this is the amazing 3d effects that I got for my lips I prefer to apply liquid lipstick because it lasts longer for prom but again it's up to you if you don't like to use a liquid lipstick you can change it and use what you feel comfortable with prom is a special day so don't try anything new or any product that is new for you because you don't know what to expect and this is a special day you don't want to ruin it try to use the products that you already know that you already know how it works for your skin type and all that stuff so let's avoid any possible mistake oh and for blush i'm using the color fetish by artist culture i love this color it's so amazing and will give a lot of life in my face this product have a little bit of shimmer and is so beautiful so that's it my angels this is the final result i really hope that you enjoyed this makeup look i love it so please don't stop this video if you like it don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more news and follow me on instagram to see more pictures of my work and also one more thing hit the notification bell here below to make sure that you're receiving all my new tutorials thank you so much for watching again and i see you in the next videos bye